Welcome to our channel, where we dive headfirst into the mysteries of the universe. I'm thrilled to take you on an interstellar journey that begins with a seemingly unassuming moon and ends with jaw-dropping astonishment. Enceladus, Saturn's sixth largest moon, might seem like just another celestial neighbor. But don't be fooled by its unpretentious appearance. This icy moon has secrets that are about to blow your mind. Imagine water vapor jets shooting out from its southern hemisphere. Yes, you heard that right. Thanks to the extraordinary Cassini mission, we've unraveled some of Enceladus's enigmas. We might know more about this icy wonder than we do about some of the more prominent moons orbiting other planets. But hold on, we're not stopping at the surface. The true mysteries lie within. So get ready to embark on a voyage that will stretch your imagination and challenge your understanding of our cosmic neighborhood. We're delving into Enceladus like never before, uncovering its secrets and exploring its place in the grand scheme of our solar system. But wait, there's more. Before we plunge into the depths of Enceladus, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel so you won't miss any of the awe-inspiring cosmic revelations we bring you. Enceladus boasts a special spot in Saturn's entourage, residing as the 14th closest moon for now at least. Its orbit, taking only 33 hours to complete, is a well-choreographed waltz with Saturn's rings, a symphony of gravitational interactions, sharing a 2 ratio 1 orbital resonance with Dione. Enceladus manages a stunning orbital tango, causing tidal deformations that heat its core, a phenomenon pivotal in understanding its intriguing properties. Picture a world coated in layers of pristine ice, a giant orb glistening with a dazzling albedo of 0.81, a cosmic snow-white hue that defines Enceladus. Its core is predominantly made of water, suggesting a frozen ocean world lurking beneath the surface. At noon, its temperature plummets to a bone-chilling minus 200 degrees Celsius, its brilliant whiteness reflecting sunlight into the cosmos. But as we venture more profound, an unexpected warmth begins to brew. Approximately 30 to 40 kilometer beneath Enceladus's icy surface, pressures build and the effects of its orbit's tidal deformation manifest. The generated heat has managed the extraordinary feat of thawing the ice, creating pockets of liquid water. Could these subsurface oceans house complex ecosystems akin to Earth's thermal vents? The intriguing possibilities are enough to send shivers down our cosmic spine. Prepare to be amazed as Enceladus flexes its muscles in the form of cryovolcanism. Gigantic plumes of water erupt from fractures in its icy crust propelling water vapor at speeds exceeding 2,000 km per hour. These powerful jets contribute to Saturn's E-ring, the bluest object in the solar system, showcasing Enceladus's remarkable influence on its celestial surroundings. When the Cassini spacecraft unexpectedly journeyed through Enceladus's plumes, it unveiled a treasure trove of insights. The cosmic dust analyzer, though not tailored for this task, revealed a menagerie of substances from water to amino acids, carbon dioxide, nitrogen and methane. The potential presence of amino acids ignites our curiosity, sparking questions about possible life forms lurking beneath the icy exterior. Scientists have been donning their cosmic detective hats to piece together Enceladus's hidden truths. Here's the heavenly scoop. While we've got quite the menu of evidence suggesting an underground ocean, the internal structure of this moon remains a cosmic puzzle. Back in the day, some folks believed Enceladus was one big watery wonderland from top to bottom, but oh no, Cassini had other plans. Data is beamed back, hinting that Enceladus's heftiness was a tad more than anticipated. Mass matters, folks. Hold on to your asteroid belts because scientists are leaning towards a differentiated theory. Yep, Enceladus might just be an exquisite cosmic layer cake with distinct layers lurking beneath its icy surface. Now we're talking about a small fry here, measuring about 500 kilometers across. It's the cosmic equivalent of towing the line between being gravity-rounded and not. Ever met Neptune's Proteus? Similar in size, but not as snazzily rounded. If this moon's indeed playing the layer game, it's speculated that a rocky core takes center stage. Hold your applause. This rocky core might just be responsible for the thermal vents causing the plumes that Enceladus is famous for. And here's where it gets really exciting. A rocky ocean floor could spell the ingredients for life as we know it. Nutrients, minerals and amino acids could be cooking up a space stew, 
primed for life's grand entrance. Picture this, Cassini, our trusty explorer, soaring over Enceladus, mapping out its thermal emissions. And guess what? Those jets of steam line up perfectly with the moon's iconic tiger stripes. Think of them as the moon's fashionable, albeit mysterious, signature. These tiger stripes, about 130 kilometers long, 2 kilometers wide, and 500 meters deep, turn out to be tectonic fractures in its icy crust. Talk about a moon with style and substance. Hold on to your cosmic hats because this moon's surface is playing tricks on time itself. Enceladus showcases virtually no impact craters across its southern hemisphere, and not a whole lot elsewhere. How's that possible? Well, it's like this. While its thin atmosphere can't fully shield it from asteroids, some of the ejected water from its plumes does settle back on the surface. And that, my friends, is the ultimate wrinkle-smoothing treatment, keeping Enceladus young and fresh. Now, let's talk topography. Brace yourself for a surprising revelation. Enceladus doesn't do mountain ranges, but it does have a rough terrain around its southern pole. Zoom in, and you'll witness a view that seems straight out of a frozen fantasy. Glacier-like expanses smoothed by the plume's water and pocked with jagged areas. Paint a captivating picture of this moon's surface artistry. Switching poles reveals a striking contrast. While tectonic fractures grace the north as well, the distinct lack of plumes means the surface here is like the wise elder, donning the wear and tear of time through craters. It's a stark reminder that even in space, history leaves its mark. Hold on, space fans. Here's the kicker. Cassini swooped close enough to capture the tiger stripes in stunning detail, unveiling a scene that could only be dreamed of on Earth. It's as if the surface was a canvas subjected to cosmic origami folding, squashing and shifting to create otherworldly patterns in the ice. Now here's the cosmic heartbreak. Cassini's mission is done, leaving us without an orbiting detective around Saturn. Mission proposals and dreams for further exploration tease us from afar, but we'll have to wait a couple of decades before we get back to Enceladus. Oh, the agony of cosmic patience. Damn boy, thanks for joining in on this cosmic journey with us. Enceladus, Saturn's enigmatic ice moon, continues to astonish NASA scientists with its secrets. Just as Enceladus holds its mysteries, remember to safeguard your online secrets too, like credit card details and personal info from the wrong hands. And hey, while we unravel the mysteries of the universe, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. Stay curious, stay tuned, and keep exploring the wonders of space right here.